the Indy Dog Whisperer has tips for helping your dog play with you politely. And yes. also joining us is Tina White. Yes, so. Tina White is a friend of mine. This is Oliver, the corgi, and he's on the couch, isn't he? Yes. <laughs> That's okay. We'll, we'll allow it. We'll yeah. allow do they, it. Do corgi shed at all? Or? We'll see. Yeah. I'll go home. I know the answer. answer. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. Yeah. so no. what, what I want to talk yeah. about today, this guy loves his tennis ball. And you probably saw in the tease, he'll bring it up, bring it up, and, and you... What are some of the things he's done to demand? Tell me some of oh that. because I... So if you're not paying attention to him, he will take that ball and just continually drop yes. it at your feet. And occasionally, he will bark at you. Mm -hmm. Like, hey, I'm here. Yes. Don't you see me? Exactly. <laughs> and, and, and part of what I, a lot of people say to me, well, my dog always demands to play. It gets obnoxious. It gets obnoxious. What do I do? It's important to understand that demand is demand when it comes to a dog. Mm -hmm. Just because they want to play, is still demand, so we can't have that. Your leadership means you can't demand anything. Of You're them. the boss. Exactly. So, so shoving toys in your lap, dropping a toy, and barking insistently in front of you, it, demand equals dominance for a dog. It's saying, mm -hmm. do this for me. Mm -hmm. No, you don't call shots. I'll play with you when you're relaxed, and I decide to. But I'm not going to play because you say, Rrr! Rrr! So, do it. So when he does and he drops the ball in your lap, what do you do? Just sit there and just Ex do so, nothing? I'm glad you brought that up, Randy. That's point two. Oh, is it really? <laughs> oh, okay. So yeah. you're just flowing right along. Yeah. Just, it seemed like you'd done this Didn't for a while. Didn't even know it. Wow. <laughs> no. So number two is claim the toy before playing. That means I'll set the toy on the ground, and Tina does this as well. I'll set the toy on the ground. I'll stand over it. If they come for it, I'll step up and say, uh-uh, and back them off and mm -hmm. leave it between my feet because what I'm telling them is, it belongs to me. You don't have a right to tell me what to do with my own toy. Okay. So now I'm going to run them out of my zone. So you're in control, not the dog. Yes, it's right. exactly. It's my toy. I mean, it's how long yours. does it take for the dog to understand that? Well, it, well, depends on the dog. Yeah, it, and and I'll, and I'll say that if the dog is questioning you, I wait for the dog to relax. If the dog goes, hurt, I'll get up and say, hey, and give him a little poke. I do mm -hmm. it to you, but I don't want to offend you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so, used to it going out there. So. So, so once the dog relaxes and says, okay, it's their toy, just forget it, then I can say, ready? Now let's play. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's on my terms. It's always important, too, to play in a focused way. So when you play with a dog, it's, it, it's best not to... Oh, let's go! Let's go! Like the bag and strips. Is that you? Mm -hmm. Oh, really? <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> let's play, buddy! Woo! Mickey Mouse voice. Oh, yeah. Let's so, go! So, so the problem with that voice is it generates a lot of excitement yeah. without focus. Okay. Mm -hmm. You want them to focus. Draw focus to your face when you play, too. Get them to look in your eyes. That's really important. Because hmm. they're watching you for cues. What, is it time to go now? Is it time to get... Let's go. Um, play like it's a job. I always tell people, play with your dog like it's a job, not just like we're losing control at Disneyland. Okay. Fo 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 I get focus. It. Okay. Focus. So, mm -hmm. yes. So there's always hope. Always. Can you teach an old dog new tricks there, I guess? Or Are you, uh, yeah. you asking about the dog? Or about me? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. You're kidding. I mean, for me, anyway. <laughs> Nathan, I appreciate that. Tina, thanks for coming in. <laughs> Oliver. Oh, yeah. That's the last you thing you're supposed to do listen. here. Oh, <laughs> That's right. Carrie, bail us out. Oh, oh. My